California voters are also voicing their feelings about President Biden dropping out of the race. KCRA 3's Andres Valle has been out talking to voters and he joins us live downtown tonight. Andres, what have people been telling you? Well, it's been sort of kind of a mixed bag with some people giving their support to Joe Biden while others are saying that they're happy he dropped out of the race. I don't think he did anything for our economy, for our people in, uh, out here in California, United States in general. Well, it caught me by surprise, man. I thought it was fake news because I saw it on Facebook. I have mixed feelings. Mixed feelings in Sacramento's downtown commons over news of President Joe Biden ending his re-election bid. Biden officially endorsing Vice President Kamala Harris to lead Democrats against former President Donald Trump. Something Louis Robinson feels is the right decision to do. Here's a chance to make history again. There's never been a female president. And with conjunction with what's going on in the WNBA right now, you know, the women are rising, they're surging. It's time, you know, maybe time to do that. But people like Luis Torres think Donald Trump is the right choice for voters. We're just like kind of falling down because, you know, Joe Biden. So I feel like we should really speak up and make it happen around here and make some money, make America great again. So that's what I think. 18 year old Isaiah Feta expressing his frustrations with Biden as well. I like a president who knows how to like speak for himself. I mean, coming off uh, watching the debate, I mean, he was stuttering an awful lot. Michael Roy choosing to stand with Biden and is asking fellow Democrats to support Harris. He did the right thing. Um, he did a wonderful job as president. I thought he did a good job as president. If you're a Democrat, I'd say let's unite behind Kamala or someone. But let's really push hard. Now, back in 2020, California's voter turnout for the presidential election was roughly over 80 percent. Uh, but with today's dramatic events and uh, President Biden dropping out, there could be some new sparks, new interest into this election, which means there is that chance there could be more voters casting their ballots in November. Live in downtown Sacramento, I'm Andres Valle for KCRA 3 News. Yeah.